Black Snow is a satirical novel by Mikhail Bulgakov, ostensibly the theatrical novel he was known to have been working on following his play The Cabal of Hypocrites. It is a rich and complex work that provides a piercing look at the world of Moscow theater in the early 20th century. The novel is centered around the character of Sergei Leontievich Maksudov, an unsuccessful writer who tries to commit suicide one night but is interrupted by a visit from the editor of a leading Moscow literary magazine. This editor has read Maksudov's novel and believes it has potential to be adapted into a play. Maksudov's fortunes appear to change overnight, and he is thrust into the theatrical world. Maksudov's novel-turned-play catches the attention of the legendary and tyrannical director, Ivan Vasilievich, who is thinly-veiled caricature of the real theater director, Konstantin Stanislavsky. Even Vasilievich leads the independent theater and decides that Maksudov's play will become the next great project for his company. The process of bringing the play to the stage is arduous and fraught with difficulties. Maksudov, as a newcomer to the world of theater, is naive to its politics and intricacies. He witnesses firsthand the petty jealousies, the backstabbing, the egos, and the rampant hypocrisy of the theater people. As rehearsals progress, the original intent and story of Maksudov's novel get lost in a sea of changes, critiques, and actor meltdowns. Even Vasilievich demands countless rewrites, with Maksudov's opinions becoming increasingly irrelevant to the director and his cohort. Each character in the novel represents a type within the theater world. There is the haughty prima donna, eager to shine but quick to take offense, the washed-up old actor who clings to any semblance of relevance, the conceited playwright who is jealous of Maksudov's success, and many others who all seem to move in a chaotic dance orchestrated by the megalomaniac Ivan Vasilievich. As the date of the premiere approaches, tensions rise. The leading lady throws tantrums that disrupt rehearsals, and a well-known critic threatens to write a scathing review before even seeing the play. In the anguish of this process, Maksudov oscillates between elation at his sudden good fortune and despair as his work is mangled beyond recognition. Throughout the plot, Bulgakov weaves in commentary on censorship and the constant fear artists lived under during the Soviet regime. The playwright struggled to preserve the integrity of his work against the demands of the theater symbolizes the larger struggle of artists trying to maintain their vision amidst a repressive political environment. Maksudov experiences a surreal string of occurrences where the boundaries between his play's scenes, his life, and his imagination become blurred. In the harrowing climax of the novel, Maksudov is pushed to his limits. The play's premiere is a mixture of success and disaster. The audience's reactions are divided, and Maksudov is left bewildered by the final product of his months of labor. The independent theater's politics have so mangled his original vision that he barely recognizes it. He becomes increasingly disenchanted with the theater world, feeling that it has consumed and regurgitated his creative work, robbing it of its soul. Bulgakov's narrative style is characterized by sharp wit, dark humor, and a sense of the absurd, painting a vivid and somewhat grotesque portrait of the theater world. This portrayal casts a broader critique on the socio-political landscape of the time, particularly the ways in which art and artists are manipulated, censored, and often destroyed by the regimes under which they live. In Black Snow, we witness Maksudov's transformation from a despondent writer to a playwriting sensation, only to spiral down into disenchantment and a kind of madness as the true nature of his circumstances become clear. The novel closes on a disillusioned and disheartened Maksudov, who carries the scars of having collided with the relentless and unforgiving machine of the theater. Mikhail Bulgakov wrote Black Snow as a semi-autobiographical piece towards the end of his life. His own frustrations with literary censorship, the compromises required to produce his plays, and the absurdities of Soviet bureaucracy are imbued within the text. This gives a deeply personal touch to the narrative, as Bulgakov himself experienced the trials and tribulations of being an artist under an oppressive government. Black Snow is a complex examination of the tumultuous relationship between the artist and the institutions that display his creations. Through Maksudov's journey, Bulgakov exposes the dark and often ridiculous underbelly of artistic production, 
revealing how the beauty and truth of art can be utterly distorted by those who claim to be its guardians.